in the morning I'm thinking about money I need it, I want it I can't even sleep Could be gone any moment Know the cops looking for me I'm not stopping or slowing Cause I got Them niggas different <laughs> Them niggas way different My nigga Pat State never would have done that Nah that's some nigga shit. Let's take a shot to my nigga Pat Stay. My nigga yeah, Pat Stay. You know what I mean? Oh, man, listen. Yeah, what? My guy, man, listen, yeah, but I'm going to tell yeah. you, my son brings that trophy around everywhere, right? Hell yeah, hell you know, yeah. Mike, you got to stop bringing that everywhere, man. <laughs> you know, you know the, the, the funny nigga of the year. <laughs> Yo, that, we got some help for giving you that a little bit. I'm like, man, fuck y'all. Oh, yeah, no, no, I posted it. I posted it, and I said, I just, first of all, I just want to thank God. You know, yeah. whatever, whatever, right? I that shit. People got on me about that, but you know what I mean? I didn't make this shit. But the award was named before you won it, so it's yeah. like, what, I'm going to change it? Like, that's anyway. racist. Like, yeah. fuck you. Listen, yeah, so, <laughs> but my son, that's his trophy. He claims it. He, he, that's him. I can't take it from him. He brings it everywhere. He brought it to daycare once. I was like, get that back here, man. <laughs> you can't. Shout out to your son. I like him, man. Yeah, but he's you gotta live with no rules, man. Yeah. Salute to him, man. Shout out to the trappers. We are back lit. It's the other handy man battle rap trap, and we definitely got the streets. If you haven't heard the news, you know what I'm saying? Um, Pat Stay has passed away. He was a victim of a stabbing. Um, we gonna keep this stream all about him, all positive. No negativity. Anybody who put anything negative in the chat, I'm going to just block y'all. Y'all will not be acknowledged or anything. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to pull a little shot up real quick for the homie. And we're and we going to have a moment of silence before we even go any further. Matter of fact, we're going to do a double shot. We're going to do a double shot, man. You know what I'm saying? Um, shout out to Past Day, man. Always show love to the trap. Always show love to me. You know what I'm saying? We done, we done talk personally, off camera, on camera. You know what I mean? It, it was a great deal of respect for for one of one of uh, uh, our Mount Rushmore candidates, one of our GOAT MCs, one of one of the faces of this shit. So uh, with that being said, man, I just want to do a moment of silence before we go any further. We're going to look at the battle. One of the, We're going to look at two of what I think is his best battles. You know what I mean? One of them being versus Tay Rock on URL. One of them being versus Sharon on KOTD. You know what I'm saying? But before we go any further, man, I got to show him love for showing me love. You know what I mean? Moment of silence. Rest in peace, rest state, past state, man. Fucked up, man. I appreciate everybody who, who participated in that moment of silence with me. Yeah, you know I mean, I'm gonna do another one after the battle, in between battles and all that. Round. All right, I'm gonna pause it real quick. I just uh just just seen this article. Yeah, you know I mean, I don't know if y'all noticed I was kind of off to myself for a second. Yeah, you know I'm saying the past day. This, this is from the uh, CBC News. Yeah, I mean, this is an update just so, yeah, I mean, people know that it, it, it's <clears throat> verified or whatever. Uh, Past day acclaimed battle rapper identified as victim of fatal Halifax shooting. Oh, stabbing. I apologize. My bad. My, my, my brain fucked up, bro. <sighs> Past day acclaimed battle rapper identified as victim of fatal Halifax stabbing. Stay was revered for his work in com competitions involving rappers verbally attacking each other. Ew, I, I don't like the, I don't like the opening sentence. That was whack as fuck. What the fuck was that? Ayo, uh, acclaimed Nova Scotia battle rapper Pat Stay was the victim of a fatal stabbing in downtown Halifax early Sunday. CBC News has learned Halifax Regional Police has not identified Stay as the victim. But Stay's brother, Peter Stay, confirmed the news to CBC. Police say they were called to the 1600 block of Lower Water Street around 1236 a.m. 
They got the picture from uh, Pat Stay vs. Real Sick right there. Stay was taken to the hospital where he later died. The, the Dartmouth N NS was that Nova Scotia man was revered for his work in rap battles where two rappers would verbally attack each other in front of an audience. Uh, they could have wrote that better. Stay had a large social media following and put out a new track two days ago that has already amassed more than 50,000 views on YouTube, even more on all the other social media networks. Um, the video even includes a brief quote from Canadian rapper Drake who praised Stay. Pat Stay is definitely one of, if not the best, he said in the video. Police are asking anyone with information about the stabbing to call them at is the number right here. Yeah, man. Uh, so, yeah. That's the... You know. That's the first article, for real. Definitely could have wrote that way better. Um, clearly written by someone that's not in the know. London Jen will be writing the article up. Um, for allhiphop.com. So, so, we waiting for that. I'm hitting it right now. We we need London Jen. Yeah. Yeah. We need we need her article because that's some bullshit right there. Boss man facts. Can we get a quick moment of silence for real? That's a fact. Yeah, we're gonna do that. We gonna we gonna do another moment of silence before this second round. And and, and I'm not gonna lie, y'all. This is a perfect time. To do a moment of silence, because this is a legendary fucking round from Pat Stay. So we're going to do this moment of silence, and we're going to look at this motherfucking legendary motherfucking round. Yeah, this shit hurt the culture, man. This shit hurt the culture. You know what I mean? I, sh I shed tears this morning, man. I ain't want to believe this shit was true. I seen articles. That was the first article where it actually said his name. But I knew it had been confirmed behind the scenes, though. And, uh, man, uh, this shit is fucked up, bro. Shit is fucked up, bro. Shout out Pat Stay, man. I'm going to take this shot, man. If you a Battle Rap Trap fan, you know Pat Stay. A couple years ago, we started the awards, the Battle Rap Awards called the Trappies. And we was giving away a Funny Nigga of the Year award. Now, unbeknownst to us... Pat Stay would be voted the funny nigga of the year. And the winner is... Ah, hey, wake up. What are we going to do? We have... Y'all ready? No, we just did a whole drum roll. Pat Stay! Pat you Stay. heard of me. Yeah, you heard of me. I know you heard of me. You heard of me. Bitch, you heard of me. I know you heard of me. You heard of me. Everybody say funny nigga of the year, boy. Dude, that's what I say. What's up, everybody? Pat Stay. Listen, I just want to say thank you for everybody voting for me for uh, Funny Personality of the Year. I'll take it. Fuck it, man. Can't wait to get my trophy, man. Much love. Peace. Shout out, Patrick. Shout out, Pat, Shout out hey, Pat so Stay, man. I don't care. Of course, he's not a nigga. He's, he's a white guy. So we had to figure out, should we still call it the Funny Nigga of the Year Award or call it the Comedian? Man, we sent him a Funny Nigga of the Year Award, man. Shout out Pat Stay, the funny nigga, the motherfucking yeah, man. He sent us a motherfucking, uh, I'm gonna find it, I'm gonna find it. He, he sent us a speech back, all that. Yeah, you know I mean, rest in peace to the motherfucking legend, Pat Stay. The culture gonna miss you, bro. The culture's going to miss you, bro. Shiva Jones, yeah, he sent us back a, a, a thank you speech and everything. I'm gonna find it, man. Like, man, man Pat Stay always showed the trap love, though, so I gotta show so much. Because he didn't have to. All right, so first off, y'all see. We in here like swimwear, man. Say something. Pat Stay love. This what we doing. This what we doing. This what we doing. Y'all don't know about this, but it's my new shit. All right, bet. Here's mine. You feel me? You feel me? Hey, Remy Ma on stage too, just let y'all know. All right, here we go. Let's go. Shout out Remy Ma. Had to show us love. He he's so far beyond showing any platform love. He could do what the fuck he want to do. But if you ever been around him, he he always had a different glow to him. It was never it was never I'm better than you or I'm I'm bigger than you. It was yo, let's have fun and joke and talk about stupid shit for no reason and and not take life serious. Because you never know when the shit can end, man. That was the vibe he always gave off, man. And that's the craziest shit about it, man. 
Last time I seen him, London Jen in the house, let her know we waiting for your article, London Jen, because whoever wrote that one is ass. Um, last time I seen him was hilarious because it was at Remy's event. And, and you know, Past Day was always fucking with J2 online because J2's a homosexual or whatever. And Past Day always straddled the line of, of some shit, saying some shit that other people wouldn't usually say. So he was kind of, you know, flirting with J2 for lack of a better word. Come to find out they had never met. So I seen Past Day, I'm talking to Past Day. J2 walks up. And I'm thinking they know each other or some shit. And so they start, we all start talking. I'm like, oh, y'all never met. These motherfuckers had never met. I'm, I'm witnessing them meet each other for the first time after all this shit on, on Twitter, man. It's, uh, oh, check, check my phone. I'm going to check my phone, man. Rest in peace, past day, man. Moment of silence, please, please, please. We're going to celebrate, though. We're going to celebrate life. We're going to celebrate life. You know what I'm saying? So what I'm supposed to check? My email? What, 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 which one am I checking? Okay. It's already published? Okay. All right. It's already published. Let me see. We're going we gonna, we gonna to pull up a better article, yo. We're going to pull up a better article because fuck that article. Talking about people verbally attacking each other, man. How, how about creatively expressing themselves, man? <clears throat> Let me see this. Hip-hop community mourns battle rap titan, Pat State. That's how the fuck you start a motherfucking article right there. Tributes are flooding in for legendary Canadian battle rapper Paste, who was reportedly fatally stabbed to death early Sunday morning. What's this? Who, who is this nigga? Smack? Who is this nigga? I thought he had something to do with it and shit. Okay. All right. That's an ad. I was, I was, okay. All right. Reports began to surface early Sunday morning that the Nova Scotia native was fatally stabbed following a night out in Halifax. Local news reports say police are investigating a suspicious death after being called to the waterfront around 12.30 a.m. following a report of someone armed with a weapon. When officers arrived, they found a man suffering from stab wounds. He was rushed to the hospital but tragically died from his injuries. Cops are yet to, cops are yet to name the victim, but sources close to Pat State confirmed his passing. Police investigating the stabbing are yet to give details of any potential suspects. They have called for members of the public with any information to come forward. The Battle Rock community has been left in shock at the news. One of their legends has passed. Tributes began flooding and his fans and fellow battlers alike were stunned at the news of his passing. The talented wordsmith was... <clears throat> I, I need shit like that. The talented wordsmith was internationally renowned after his performances on leagues across the world. He has numerous big stage appearances with the Ultimate Rap League, King of the Dot, Rare Breed Entertainment, U-Dub, Don't Flop, and many more. The rapper has recently called out the game, challenging him to a rap battle. After the Compton rapper dropped his Black Slim Shady track, Pat Stay had just dropped his own diss track to the game Warm Up on Friday, just two days before his passing. Pat Stay's final Instagram story shows the rapper celebrating with his loved ones, apparently at the wedding of a couple whom he introduced. Y'all niggas better not break up. That's all the fuck I gotta say. Y'all better last forever. AllHipHop.com extends thoughts and prayers to the family and loved ones of Pat Stay during the difficult time. It's a, it's a Patty right there, but 
We know that mean Pat right there. And that's a way, that's a way, 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 way better article. Way better article. Way better article. Way more respect on his name. Very necessary. Great job, Jeff. Great job, Jeff. Great job doing that for us. You know what I mean? Great job doing that for us. You know what I mean? Make sure if you're on Twitter, wherever you at, share that article right there. Don't share whatever article the, the unaware, uncultured motherfuckers is going to put out. Share that article. And stay in tune with, with, with her covering that shit. Because don't TMZ and CBC and whoever the fuck, they not, they not aware. They not a part of the culture, man. And they're not putting respect on that man's name already. Talking about verbally attacking. Condolences to his family and friends. Facts, AR9. Facts. Talented wordsmith is way better than verbally attacking people in front of people. Way better. Like, what the fuck, man? All right, so that being said, we're going to get into this legendary second round, man. Yeah, you know I mean, I, I feel like it's only right. It's only right. Let's do that. In the morning, I'm thinking about money. I need it, I want it. I can't even sleep, could be gone any moment. Know the cops looking for me. I'm not stopping or slowing, cause I gotta.